Shalom to everyone who is watching and listening to me right about now. Dear brothers and sisters, I have an amazing word just for you. Remember that you are not watching this message by mistake. You have not clicked on this video by coincidence. There is a reason as to why you are watching me right about now. Dear brothers and sisters, I'm here always to encourage you. Every time you see my face, every time you listen to my voice, these are words that are going to help you out. I know some of you are struggling in life. Some of you financially, things are not working out the way you expected them. Some of you, your health has been deteriorating. But I want to encourage you that the word of God can make you well. Jesus wants you to prosper. Jesus wants you to live and not die. It is the enemy that is attacking you. It is the enemy that is trying to confuse you. But God loves you. God is in that situation with you and ready to help you. You have to just call upon the name of the Lord. The Bible says it clear. Call upon the name of the Lord and you will be saved. Right now as I speak, somebody will be saved. Somebody, when you start calling the name of the Lord, I'm telling you, that which had held you for so long will start living. Those afflictions will live. Trust in God. So, my brothers and sisters, it is good to see all those that are watching me for the very first time. Even those that have been watching me on a daily basis. I welcome you to this channel. Please, subscribe to this channel. Turn on all the notifications so that you may be able to receive future videos. Remember that every day, every single day, Monday to Monday, I release videos on this YouTube channel. I release videos. So go to the video section and you see the number of videos I've been releasing. I've been consistent releasing those videos. And also on a weekly basis, I have live streams where I pray for you. I interact with you. I get to know you. You type in your comments live and I pray for you. And even right now as I'm speaking this word, I could be live. I could be live praying for you. So it is important that you get connected to this uh, ministry. My brothers and sisters, today's amazing word is you are wiser than all your enemies. They think that you were a fool for you believing in Christ. They think that you are out of your mind. But you are wiser than them. And you see, they are going to realize it when it's too late. That they needed you. They need you. Because you are the light of the world. Without you, they are going to perish. Brothers and sisters, let me read to you a word that is from the book of Psalms, uh, chapter 119, verse 97 to around 100 and 4. Psalms, chapter 119, verse 97 to 100 and 4. The Bible says it clear. Oh, how I love your law. It is the meditation all the day. You through your commandments, make me wiser than my enemies, for they are ever with me. I have more understanding than all my teachers, for your testimonies are my meditation. I understand more than the ancients, because I keep your precepts. I have restrained my feet from every evil way, that I may keep your word. I have not departed from your judgments. For you yourself have taught me how sweet are your words to my test, sweeter than honey to my mouth. Through your precepts, I get understanding. Therefore, I hate every false way. This was the writings of the psalmist. He says he hated every false way. Every way that led it to that was leading to falsehood, he hated it. And the Bible says that through your precepts, I get understanding. Do you need clarity? Do you need understanding in what you are going through? In the things that God has uh, prepared for you? It is through the word of God that you will get understanding. This is why I encourage every single person to read the word of God on a daily basis. Let no day pass by you without reading at least 
a scripture. Start with one scripture. Graduate to two scriptures, five scriptures, ten scriptures. It is important for you because the word of God is medicine. It will heal you. Now the Bible says that it is that you, through your commandments, make me wiser than my enemies. The psalmist had realized a secret that the world has not yet realized. The world is looking for wisdom, but they don't know that it is in the word of God. It is not in the world, but in the word of God. That's where you find pure wisdom. This is why Daniel was so wiser. Wiser than all his enemies. The Bible says that Daniel was ten times wiser than the sorcerers, the magicians, the uh, all the astrologers. He was ten times, not one time, not two times but 10 times wiser than them. That is a huge margin. So my brothers and sisters, I want you to trust in God. I want you to have faith in God because he has made you wiser. As long as you have Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you are wiser than your enemies. The Bible says, for they are ever with me. I have more understanding than all my teachers. Even those that teach you new things, before you, they even teach you, 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 you have more understanding than them. Some of them teach things that they don't actually comprehend. But you comprehend them. Because you have the Spirit of God residing in you. The Bible says, I understand more than the ancients. Because I keep your precepts. I have restrained my feet from every evil way. Hmm. What a powerful word. And the Bible says, how sweet are your words to my taste. They are sweet, sweeter than honey to my mouth. That is the word of God. It is sweeter than honey. You see, in those days, when uh, sweetness was equated to honey. Yes, because the honey, actual honey is, was used as medicine. And even I think in this, uh, in this generation, people still use honey. It still has um, healing properties. Honey still has healing, some healing properties. Even doctors will tell you about honey. It's more preferable actually to take honey than sugar. Mm, more preferable to take honey than sugar. So, when you allow God in your life, you treasure God. You uh, meditate on his word day and night. You will avoid a lot of things. You will be able to overcome your enemies. That is the truth. This is why I encourage you to always get connected to platforms that speak the word of God. Brothers and sisters, I'm running out of time, but I'm not running out of good news. Until next time, Shalom.